Okay, welcome back. Just gonna go ahead and get started. I've been really excited to play again. I feel like I didn't play very long yesterday. Oh. <laughs> testing, testing. Hello, every. Oh dear, so sorry about that. The volume was a little loud there. Hello, everyone. Starting today, I'll be doing an island-wide broadcast full of island updates, goings-on, and such. Hmm? I'll go over some of the things that are very important to island life, so lend me your island ears for a short time. Now, it's only fitting that we kick off this daily ritual with a doozy of an island announcement. The Fika Airport is now open for business. Starting today, you can use online or local communication to fly to other islands for a visit. That's not all, no. The airport counter now offers postal services. And just like the resident services center, the airport is open 24 hours a day, so please do drop by for a look. That's all from me. I do hope you all enjoy another fine day of luxurious fika living. Oops. Pardon me. It's a little early in the morning. Okay, I haven't decided what I want to do today. But I don't really know what there- oh, I forgot, I have mail. I don't really know what there is to do. Oh, a letter from mom. Dear Bailey- oh, my dear Billy, my goodness. How's your new life treating you? Are you eating well? Brushing your teeth? Washing behind your ears? Oh dear, I'm all worked up. Here's a little something to help you out. Okay. And Nintendo? Thanks for using the specially colored Joy-Con controllers releasing in association with Animal Crossing New Horizons. To show our appreciation, we're sending you this gift. We hope you enjoy it. Okay. That's cool. I did buy the Animal Crossing exclusive Switch because I just couldn't help myself. Thank you for downloading the update. We'd like to give you a present to show our appreciation. Okay. Lots of presents. And dear Billy, congratulations on your big move. We hope you enjoy your new island life. To celebrate this fresh start, we'd like to give you a gift that's sure to come in handy. Oh, okay. Let's open these up. So the first one was from mom. Oh, pear, oh, pears. Okay, wow, that's really early to be getting a second fruit, I feel like. This is from Nintendo. Oh, that's cute. My character in game gets to have it. The, this is, by the way, the Animal Crossing New Horizons Nintendo Switch. This is also from Nintendo. A Nintendo Switch. <laughs> a lot of product placement. And a simple DIY workbench. I know I need to get to work, but I really want to look at the Switch in my tent, so I'm going to do that. So my plan for today is to kind of just get used to playing the game because, oh, I think I have a notification, maybe? Eh, anyways. My plan today is to get used to the game because I have only played it for about 45 minutes now and just kind of get a good idea of what I should do next. So, oh, is this a DIY recipe? I wonder how I can memorize it. Okay. I wonder as well. Oh. Okay. I guess I can't grab that. Uh, Timmy! Oh, sorry, Tommy. Oh, Billy, it's great to see you. We're keeping resident services open at night. Oh, so feel free to stop by if you need to talk about anything. For the time being, I'll be out and checking in with everyone, seeing how folks are doing. If you're ever unsure about what you should do, don't hesitate to stop me for a chat. Okay. Let's go in here. See what Nook has to say.
Oh, cutscene. Ah, Billy, welcome, welcome. As you can see, it's quite cozy in here. It's funny how cozy doesn't always mean comfortable, right? <laughs> Let me know if you need advice on how to spend your time on this island, or anything else. If you need some advice about basic island materials, you should talk to Timmy. He can help you procure some of the essentials for thriving in our little paradise. And if you want to earn some bells, he has a rather generous policy of purchasing just about anything. <laughs> Not strictly advisable from a business perspective, but quite generous. <laughs> So stingy. Oh, one more important thing. I'm offering a free DIY workshop that can help you really build out your island experience. I think it would be quite useful, so I do hope you take me up on it. Yep. Yeah. Can I do it now? What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. About that workshop. Yes, yes, the DIY workshop. Each participant will make and keep their own tools and receive a set of DIY recipes. I think it will be quite useful for island life. So shall I put you down for the next available session? Yes. That's the island spirit. I happen to be free right this very moment. That's convenient. Okay, here we go. Welcome to my DIY workshop. Oh, I suppose workshop is overselling it a bit. When you see how simple it is to DIY or do it yourself, you'll understand what I mean. The basic idea is to gather materials, follow a recipe, and then craft using a workbench like this one. I'm getting kind of Minecrafty. <laughs> so today we'll be constructing a fishing rod using common materials that you can find anywhere. For this particular recipe, we require a mere five tree branches. It is admittedly a little flimsy. Now then, come see me once you've collected the materials. Okay. Five tree branches. That's cute how he waves goodbye. I also like that it's raining. I wonder if it rained for everybody on their second day? Because they're trying to get you to... Oh, hi, Rold. Yo, Billy, that spot you found for me is just incredible. Thanks. I hope we can keep looking out for each other like this. It's good to have buddies. Oh, right. I've got something here for you. Thanks again for finding a place for my place. <laughs> oh, I get a present already? That explorer's hat is perfect for Fika. You can try it on by pressing X to open- Okay, I, I know. Okay. Tutorial stuff. Let's see. <laughs> Cute! Okay, oh, focus. I need five tree branches. Okay, let's go make a fishing rod. He's cute. <laughs> ah, Billy, found the necessary materials? Well then, let's get started on crafting that fishing rod. To begin, just select a project from the workbench and get started. Go ahead, give it a try. Okay. All right. Flimsy fishing rod. Flimsy fishing rod. Say that ten times fast. I made a flimsy fishing rod. <laughs> yes, that was perfect. As you can see, crafting is quite simple, provided you have the correct recipes. And that concludes my free DIY workshop. Oh, there's just one last thing. I have a few common DIY recipes for you, free of charge, naturally. I'll just need to send them to your Nook phone. Would you mind opening it up? Okay. Oh, oh my gosh. Did he just airdrop it? Perfect. Splendid, thank you. The DIY app is now installed on your phone and ready for you to use at any time. And the flimsy fishing rod you just crafted is yours to keep. Well, I would hope so. It may not last forever, but it should serve you well for a little while at least. Speaking of fishing, I'm no master angler, but perhaps I can give you a few tips? Okay, I don't need to read. I've played Animal Crossing for ages. You just cast it and catch it when you're supposed to. <laughs> okay, um... Wait, so what were those... Sorry, what were those recipes? Here. DIY recipes. Yep. Okay. So I could build a campfire and a net with a bunch of branches okay i want to go fishing first
Don't get distracted. Distracted. Don't get distracted. Oh! <gasps> Giant clam. I feel like I'm at that stage in the game where everything... Everything's probably pretty useful to... Try to collect just to get started with some bells. Ooh, here we go. Oh. Okay. Moving on. What are these? Are these shrimpy guys? What are you doing? Hi. Do they only come out in the rain? Oh, no, I wish I had a slingshot. Oh, man. Okay, let's catch this big guy. Oh. He disagrees. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. How much you want to bet it's a, a sea bass? Oh! Red snapper! Nice! I think those are worth, like, or at least they were worth 3,000 bells in the old games. Don't ask me why I know that, please. Okay, eh, uh, there we go. Snail! Oh, man! It is actually incredible how gorgeous this game is. Just considering where we came from. Everything's been on, well, apart from the GameCube version, everything's been on a little handheld device. And I'm playing this on a television right now, and it's just gorgeous. It's really hard not to pull it. Okay. Oh! Pale chub. That's cute. Alright, let's make... I'm curious if we can catch the little shrimpy guys. So I want five tree branches to make a, because I'm, ass I'm assuming if I can pick them up, it's with a net. Shrimpy guys! Uh, do I need to sneak? Yeah, okay. I did, I caught one. I caught a wharf roach. This water loving roach has no peer. Interesting. Has no peer. Haha. <laughs> Very funny. Is our snail still here? Oh. Okay. Ooh, it's a big river fish. Come on, river fish. Come on. What? Oh, a black bass. The most metal of all fish. <laughs> okay, let's go check on... Oh wait, did I have a DIY recipe? Sweet, I learned how to make a simple workbench. Okay, that's pretty simple. Um, let me put my tools away and let's go say hi to... Oh, don't tell me. Uh, rocket? Yes. Score. Okay. Hi, Rocket. Letting you pick out my tent plot was totally the right call. Thanks a million, Billy. You rock. Really feels like things are starting off on the right foot here. This spot's giving off super good vibes. It's rad that we're looking out for each other. Let's keep doing that. Oh yeah. I was thinking about how to thank you, and I came up with a recipe for a leaf umbrella. Oh. 
All right, so the first thing I thought when I got here was, now that's a lot of weeds. That's kind of where I got the idea. It's a DIY project that uses weeds. Think about it. Weeds are the most abundant natural resource we have. Might as well use them. That's clever. Okay, so I should learn that. DIY recipe for a leaf umbrella. Okay, I need to go to Tom Nook's and figure out how to make a DIY workbench, because that way I can... Oh, so cute. Presumably I can work somewhere else and I don't have to keep going back to the tent. Maybe I can put one right next to my tent, maybe? Hopefully. And uh, yeah. Five iron hardwood and an iron nugget. Can I look at... Oh, interesting. Okay. So I can't, like, just 15 clumps of weeds? Okay. What if I want a shovel or something? What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. I found a creature. Oh, splendid. Let's have a look, shall we? You look at this guy. Oh, what a catch. I do believe this is a wharf roach. Hmm. If this island can support a wharf roach, why who knows what other fantastic creatures might be living here. I have an idea. An old friend of mine runs a museum, and I'd love to send it to him for a closer look. Would you be okay with that? Yeah. I mean, I, I might as well start building my... I'm, I, I assume I'm building my museum collection by sending it to Nook, I hope. Oh, that reminds me. This is in no way tied to your generous donation just now. <laughs> but I have a useful app to show you. Airdrop me that. Airdrop me that app, Nook. Okay. Uh, oh, Critterpedia. Okay, cool. I sent you the Critterpedia. It's a terrific resource for an aspiring island researcher such as yourself. With this one app, you'll get all the important details about the bugs and fish you catch. Yes. I do hope you'll continue to fill it up with your discoveries and share them with me too. I'm sure I'll be able to come up with some kind of additional reward. Okay. All right, so I should, I mean, I should donate one of each, right? I found a creature. Well, let's have a look. Do you think I can, oh no. I have to give them to him one by one. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and speed through some stuff like that. Oh! Just kidding. Oh, by the way, have you been taking advantage of my workbench? Yes? Come to think of it, I've seen you tinkering around a bit over there. Keep up the good work. That reminds me, I've been meaning to share some DIY recipes with you. Mind turning on your phone? Okay. This is moving very quickly, Nook. I'm, I don't know if I'm comfortable with how quickly we're moving. Okay, I just sent you a number of DIY recipes that require wood, along with the recipe to craft an axe. Yes, I think an axe would come in quite... I think an axe would come in quite useful on this island. Okay, interesting phrase, because so many other things are made of wood. I hope you keep bringing me new discoveries to examine. It's all a part of the island experience. Okay, let me go ahead and zoom through this. Oh, I got a reward. A red tulip bag. Just a little sampling of a product we sell. Go ahead and do some planting, and after a few days, you'll have beautiful blooming flowers. Anyway, give it a whirl, and if you enjoy gardening, stop by and buy more. Very cool. Cool. The flowers that grow will be very strong. They'll spring up even if you just plant them and forget them. Ah, but if you water them each day, that's where the magic happens. Okay, so flowers won't wilt anymore, maybe? Watering opens up the possibility of propagating and crossbreeding your flowers to develop rare colors. Ooh, very cool. Okay. 
And how might you water them, you ask? Did he just check a text? Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I've just sent you the DIY recipe for a watering can. My accountant warned me that giving this sort of thing away for free, but you've collected creatures for me, so this is just a part of island give and take. <laughs> I hope you'll keep bringing me new discoveries. Okay, yes, 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 I, I understand. What do you have for sale? We're still setting up, but for starters, we intend to offer a small selection of goods for our island residents. Space is limited right now, but we'll try to have some fresh stock each every day. Each and every day. I'm sure you're busy, but feel free to take a look at some of the items we're thinking of selling. Okay, thinking of selling. Oh, oh, I see. Okay. Anything catch your eye? We're not just sellers, we also buy things from you, including stuff gathered on this island. And because we want to support efforts to beautify the island, we'll even pay you a little bit in return for any weeds or trash you bring in. Ooh, nice. If you want to know whether we'll buy something, just ask. Okay. Uh, will you buy this shell? Of course, what are you offering? Well, how about... I feel like this is a crafting material, so I don't really want to sell it yet. What a giant clam. How's that sound? A giant clam, sure. 900 bells? Okay. Maybe I was a little hasty when I thought 49,000 bells was a lot. For some reason, I thought that... I don't know why. I, th I feel like I remember shells being worth a lot less than that. Alright, let's check our DIY recipes. Wow, okay. Got a lot going on here. Um... Oh, I need softwood. Okay. Tree branch. I should probably make things in order. So I should make the axe, and then I'm sure the axe will help me get softwood? I mean, that just kind of makes sense, right? Um, okay. I rolled! He's so cute! Yo, buddy, it's raining, but not on this parade. <laughs> Hey, isn't that the hat I gave you? Looks great. Really shows off your head muscle. Head muscle. <laughs> oh dear. Alright, I'm gonna start collecting some weeds, cause there's a bunch, and I want that super adorable umbrella that everybody's toting around. It is an Animal Crossing if you're not picking weeds, is it? Let's craft this. Uh, yeah. I love how they clap for me when I make something. It's like, yes, you made an umbrella. Congratulations. Okay. And an axe? Nice. I made a flimsy axe. Okay, what was it that I needed for the watering can again? Softwood. Okay, right, right, right. All right. Bye, Nook. Okay, let's see what happens when we use an axe on. Wow, that's that is a flimsy axe. Okay. Oh. Okay, three hardwoods? Should I do it again? I'm worried I'm gonna... Okay, it's not chopping down. Oh! Okay, so it seems like every tree gives you three materials? Does that seem right? Oh no! 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 I can't switch my net fast enough! Oh no! Oh no! 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 That's rude! No! Oh no! 
shoot. Capture taken. <laughs> okay. Well, that sucks. Huh. Well, just keep going. Wait, can I? <gasps> what is this? Oh, just wood. Okay. <laughs> Doesn't have to be soft or hard. All right. I've got everything. Do you think he'll notice my butt? Oh, maybe I should put my axe away. Do you think he'll notice that I got stung by bees? Oh, ew. Um, maybe you're going for a new look, but that seems a little bit extreme, buddy. Wow, whatever you got has definitely not been skipping stinger day. <laughs> I wish I had some medicine to give you, but I didn't want to mess up my aerodynamics, so I didn't bring any. Oh, but I can show you how to make medicine. It's easy to do, and this island's got everything you need. Oh, okay. The last thing you want is to get stung so much you faint. Fainting really cuts into your lap times. So make sure you keep some medicine on you. I could faint? This? Yeah. Oh, nice. Okay. And... I have a watering can. Okay, okay. I have red tulip bags. Let's go up to my tent. Pill bug. That's a tough act to swallow. Pfft. Okay. Let's put. That's probably the wrong way to go. Let's put him up. Oh, okay. Oh. All right. I'm gonna go. Okay. I'm gonna go with. I can't do that again. Okay. Fantastic. Let's find another rock then. Oh. Oh. I scared the snail. Ooh, do you think there's money rocks? It's gotta be. I mean, this is a rock rock, apparently. Oh, nice! Okay. <gasps> oh, no! How many times did I even get to use that? I didn't know tools broke. That's frustrating. Think he's got any tips yet? Ah, oh, Billy, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? What should I do? 
Yes, that is the question. Well, this island is a diverse habitat for many interesting creatures, you know, other than us. <laughs> yes, you can catch all kinds of insects and fish if you practice with your net and fishing rod. I'd be most curious to see any creatures that you do catch. By all means, bring them to me. Okay, so he's suggesting that I start bringing him things. So I'll give him the pill bug. That's nice that even though I don't have the museum yet, I'm guessing that's a yet. Oh, hold the phone, someone's calling. Blathers, is that you? Oh. oh, what splendid timing. Yes, yes, do you remember the venture we discussed? Well, it's come to fruition. I'm currently stationed on an island that we've decided to call Fika. Yes, yes, the local fauna are as abundant as expected, just as I told you. Mm -hmm. How many precisely, you ask? Well, there's no way of knowing just yet, but I have received, let's see, five outstanding specimens so far. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What? Seriously? Well, that is very exciting. Oh, but you'll have to excuse me. I'm with a customer right now. Customer? I am your resident representative. Anyways. I'm so sorry to keep you waiting. That was my friend Blathers, the one who curates a museum. Believe it or not, he's gonna come to our island to help us identify and preserve the local creatures! Ah, oh, but I could use your help, Billy. Oh. Since you've done so much scouting and collecting already, would you be able to find a spot for Blathers? We'll need a good-sized space to really build out a world-class museum, so do keep that in mind. This is exciting, it's all coming together. Oh. Blathers is coming. I've, I've got to admit, I wasn't expecting that to be so soon. I thought it would take a while, for sure. Okay, where should Blathers be? How about... Ooh. Hold on. There's a snail. Coming for you, little guy. Coming for you. Nice. Yes, I caught a snail. It's not much to brag about. Okay. <laughs> Let's put blathers. How about here? This would be a nice spot, right? Yeah. Yes. <gasps> Glathers can set up his place now. Yay! Okay. Okay, I'm excited. Oh, <laughs> my bad. Okay, Glathers is gonna get it set up. This is so exciting. I have a workbench. I have some tulips growing. Let's put my workbench outside. We can put stuff outside. Oh, this is great. Okay. Oh, I had to skirt past there, I guess. Oh, okay. Uh, what can I craft? Some log stakes. Sure. What are those for? I made some log stakes. Okay. Eh. Uh, where do those go? And what are they for? Okay. Can I sit on them? Are they just supposed to be kind of like a like a fence? Okay. I wouldn't mind putting a few more to make it kind of look like a little garden. Okay, anyways, I think I'm gonna wrap it up for today. I'm gonna keep playing and catching some fish and catching some bugs, but I'm sure you couldn't be bothered watching that. So I will see you tomorrow after I've done that. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. If you happen to stumble upon my tiny channel, let me know. Leave a like if you liked it. Please leave some comments and suggestions. Help me out. I really don't know what I'm doing. So any help would be much appreciated. All right. That's me. Thanks, guys.
Bye-bye.